What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Just like a little update. You remember when I did the uh, pouch everyday EDC pouch for your knife flashlight? And I had this knife right here. Well, we're gonna, it doesn't really work. It's I got this one at Tractor Supply. It's the bare edge. So we're gonna do a little tuning see if we can get it to uh you know go a little bit smoother because look i've been playing with this thing guys trying to break it in look still nothing so we're gonna do a little fine tuning a little oil little um sanding block we're just gonna polish it up we're just gonna polish the knife up that's exactly what we want to do so i'm not gonna bore it bore you guys with the you know yeah, maybe I will bore you. <laughs> so I'm going to take this thing apart, guys. Got my little husky set here. So let's see. Let's see if I can remember which one it is. <clears throat> let's see. Okay. It's two of them. I think it's this one. Yep. Okay. Yeah, we don't want to uh, sand it down too hard, you know, and uh, destroy the metal. Just polish, just a little polish job. Then we'll see how it uh, comes out. It should help it. I've done this to other knives, you know. Hopefully it will come out okay. That one came out easy. Okay. All right. I was looking at another knife. Um, it's made by Buck. I like Buck knives. I haven't had too too many of them, but I do like Buck knives. It's called the uh, the Highline. I believe it's called. I was just looking into it. What's this one being a little farce? Hmm. Huh. This might be stripped out. Well, that's great. I'm not sure. All right. Let me uh, play with this one, guys, and uh, I'll be back. I don't want to bore you with it. All right, guys. So I'm back. So it wasn't stripped out. I was actually using the wrong size. <laughs> so that's me, my fault. So I'm going to take this apart still. Um, yeah, there's a couple knives I uh, want. I've been on a, a flashlight kick too, guys. Um, Walmart and Amazon seem to be my, especially Amazon, we're all guilty of it. That's like my go-to. I like to try all different things. Cheap flashlights, expensive flashlights. You know. Okay, so that's off. Let's get that off. All right, the detent. <clears throat> this knife is sharp, though. I will say that it is sharp. What's the other one? Okay, it's right here. I hate these little plastic bushings. Still some oil on it from the factory. Okay, so that's that. Guessing this don't want to come out. Or it's, maybe it doesn't come out. Okay. So I got, I'm going to clean it up. I got some, you know, a little, oh, I need that out though. I need that out. I 
need this out. Oh, it's coming out. It's coming. I don't know why it's stuck in there. Hmm. There we go. I don't know why it's stuck in there. Let's clean it up. Some stuff gunked on it. Hmm. I wonder why that was so hard to get out. No clue, guys. All right. Oh, don't want to lose that. I'm clumsy tonight. So like I said, we're just going to polish around here. <clears throat> Make it easier for, hopefully, for it to slide smoothly. Because you saw it when I was flipping it, it's barely. So these are kind of cool, guys. This is, uh... I think it's 800 grit. We just want to polish it. We don't want to scar the metal or nothing. You can, the cool thing about these, you can use these wet or dry. All right. So that, yeah, that's getting smooth. Well, I'm going to work on this, guys, and I'll be back. All right, guys, we're just about done here. It doesn't take long. You know, we just want to smooth out where metal hits metal, you know what I mean? Oh, we can see that, the color. See how it's like, it's a little discolored? You just want to polish it off, guys. Same thing with this. See a little discoloration. See if we can get on the camera here to focus. Uh, probably take a minute. But you can see it better on that angle. But that's all we want to do. <clears throat> now we're going to put it back together and we're going to see if it works. So, we got those, we got that, we got to get this knife back together, uh, okay, that's why I didn't want to come out, sorry guys, just clean it up a little bit, it's a little dirty, okay, So, we are going to put the knife back together. I want to say this part goes in here. Whoop. Come on. There we go. There we go. Okay. There we go. Oh, you know what I forgot, guys? Nice. Forgot something. Feels gritty all of a sudden. Forgot these. The O rings. Which I probably should put a drop of oil. I'll do it after. What's in here that's making that sound gritty? Sounds real gritty. I don't know if you guys can pick that up on camera or the audio. I will say, it is a sharp little knife. Alright, let's get this in. Okay. Now, another one. If I can get it. 
big hands. Alright, so let's get that on. Very good. This can go over it. If I can get it. Yep. <clears throat> Got it. So we need the big ones. Whoop. Come on. Big hands don't work so great. <laughs> I keep making mistakes, guys. I forgot the detent. Duh. That would, uh, yeah, that would make it why it's so gritty. <laughs> I keep messing up on camera, guys. So, yes, here we go. Put that in. I'll tell you what. I should have had my needle nose because my hands are too big for this stuff. That's why it's gritty. I can hear it. Okay. Now let's try this again. Ah, that's better. A lot better. A lot better. Okay, put that down, put that down. Let's see if we can do this again. Ugh. Guys, I'm an amateur. I'm an amateur. Probably you guys sitting there laughing at me. See, this guy doesn't know what he's doing. <laughs> it's been a while. Since I've uh, taken apart knives, which again, simple, simple knife here, and I can't even get it. It's probably because I'm on camera. Okay, let's try this again. Why? Why is that? There we go. Okay, let's do this again. Big hand. Tell you what, guys, it does not work to have. Uh oh. It fell out. Ah, uh, guys, it's driving me crazy. I don't know why I can't get this in. I don't know why. Doesn't make sense. Come on. That's in. That's in. That's over it. That's over it. That's in. Beautiful. Right, that is in. What happened? Why is this not? All right, let's get the other screws in. And we'll see what I'm doing wrong here. And then we'll adjust it. <clears throat> Almost there, guys. Almost there. Bear with me. <laughs> All right. If you guys are looking for a precision Torx bit set, nice little guy, Husky set. I think I paid like $10, $12. Comes with Torx and screwdrivers. Great for, um,
you know, small jobs like this. Okay, so let's get these little guys in. Okay. That's one. Okay. <sighs> Why are these so pain in the butt? Alright, another one. Alright. Sorry guys, you gotta be with me here. There's another one. Put the last two in. And we are good. And hopefully I didn't mess it up. <laughs> oh, I wish I had my needle nose. Alright, that one's in. Last one, guys. A little moment of truth. See if uh, this thing got any better. I hope. Last one. Of course, it's going to be a pain. Tell you guys, I could do something, but the minute I get on camera, stuff likes to make me look like I don't know what I'm doing. I'm sure it happens to a lot of people, though. Okay. Or it's just me. If that happens to you guys, let me know. Leave a comment. I don't know if you guys, you know, other YouTubers. Alright, let's see what this thing did. Ugh, still nothing. Oh, it feels a little... Let's see. No, but still... It feels a little loose, though, now. Let me tighten her up a little bit. If not, I have no hope for this knife. I can't say it's a bad knife. It's sharp. It has... All knives have a, a purpose. I got out of tractor supply. If you see my recent video on it. It was $10. I'll throw it in the tackle box. Do whatever with it. And, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's loose. But it feels gritty now. I don't know why. I don't know why it feels gritty. Oh, here we go. Ooh. Oh, you know what it is? Oh, no. I think one of, because it's starting to work better. I don't know what the heck happened. I don't know if the tent... The, it's loose, I know that. Let me try tightening it up some more. Okay. Ooh, that works a lot better. I don't know why it's so loose, though. Well, I'm not going to bore you. I'm going to take it apart again. And when I come back, I'll tell you the mistake I did. Alright, guys. So, the problem was there was some grit in the... Where the hole where the detent goes. But now it's not too bad. It's a little bit better. Not still as smooth, but it's getting there. And we, uh, I would say, you know, it's still got some breaking in. But... It's a little bit smoother from when I first tried it. It's I like it. It's a cool little knife. I mean, for ten dollars, it has its purpose. Whether it's in the tackle box or at work cutting up boxes, and you know, but it works a lot better. You saw when I first started this, it wouldn't open. I mean, it was just nothing. But uh, yeah. 
Guys, tractor supply special, 10 bucks. And do me a favor, guys. Share, like. Let's get the algorithm going. Um, I'm starting to do, I noticed, like EDC. Um, I do everything as usual, but lately I've been going down like EDC and stuff like that. Uh, if there is something that you want to see on the channel, leave me a comment. I'll review it. You know, um, I buy all this stuff, you know, with my own money, so within reasonable. But I got something else, a Walmart buy. Like I said, I love Walmart and I love uh, Amazon, so. But please hit, hit, hit me with a like, a follow. Let's get the algorithm going. It really helps out the channel. I'm hoping we can get this channel taken off this year. I really want to take it off. So, with that said, guys, till next time, I'm out.